Hey everyone, start protecting yourself on the web at nordvpn.com slash Jimmy Door or use the code Jimmy Door and save 77%. Today's tech puts all of our important data at your fingertips, right? Your bank info, your social media passwords, your Amazon orders, everything. And between changes in net neutrality and lurking bad hombres, it really is important, more important now than ever, to protect your data and your internet experience. So the end of net neutrality means that ISPs may start preferring some websites and services over others. Running a VPN on your phone or desktop can help you avoid ISP interference. So let me tell you a little bit about NordVPN. They're the only VPN to get a perfect score from PC Mag, and the service allows you to connect up to six devices all at the same time, including Apple and Android phones. This means that you get to browse privately with military grade encryption. This means you get to protect your info when on a public airport or coffee shop connection. This means you can stop ISPs from preferring some websites and services over others. And if you use the code Jimmy Door or click the link in the description below, you're gonna save 77% off. That's www.nordvpn.com slash Jimmy Door. And use the code Jimmy Door. My, my Donald Trump caller ID tells me Lion Mitt Romney's on the line, or is it Sad Mitt or Loser Mitt? Hello? Jimmy Boy, Lion Mitt on the phone. I, what? Hey! That's not my name. Why, you, I ought to, by golly. <laughs> I'm sorry, Mitt, but that's what it says on my Trump caller ID. That's ridiculous. What version are you using? Uh, 10.1.6. Why? Well, there's a problem. What a lame-o you are, Jimmy. You need to update to version 11.2, let's drill in Yosemite. On that <laughs> version, he calls me Dick Cheese Mitt Romney. Get with it, pal. Hey, I thought you were going to distance yourself from Donald Trump to show your independence. When I am anointed senator, you'll see a big change. Anointed? Oh, did I say anointed? I, I meant chosen by the Holy Father. Uh, chosen by the Holy Father? Oh, did I say chosen by the Holy Father? I meant elected. <laughs> but you didn't get the GOP nomination for the Utah Senate, and now you have to compete in the primary. You failed to... Don't say that. Oh, geez. Now what does your Trump caller ID say? It says failure, Mitt. I prefer dick cheese. Thanks a lot. Never mind. While you're def <laughs> while you're busy defending Assad, gassing his own people, I'll be campaigning hard to win the primary of a state I, I really don't live in, nor understand <laughs> what with all the coloreds there now. Ah! I never defended anyone for gassing people. That you got that wrong. I just don't think there's real proof. Oh, you don't know the first thing about sarin gas, my friend. Really? What do you know about sarin gas? A lot. In my religion, it's the only thing we're allowed to get high on. <laughs> <laughs> so what do you consider the biggest selling point of your Senate platform? I vow to repeal Romney care if elected to the Senate. The Mitt Romney's a real dick cheese, and he's bad for our country. Once that's done, I'll just be Mitt Romney again, not a dick cheese. That's my theory anyway. <laughs> Your nephew also failed to make the primary ballot for Colorado governor. I know. What a dick cheese. <laughs> Can you give us any parting thoughts on the death of Barbara Bush? I am just so struck by what a great love story that is. Barbara and George Bush, like Abelard and Heloise, Romeo and Juliet, or even Gargantua and Pantagruel. Google it. I like to do the smarter references for the premium members. How would you compare the love between you and your wife with that of the Bushes? In a nutshell? Yes, please. If they were anything like me and What's-Her-Face, soon <laughs> after they met, they found themselves so entwined that neither could resist the bestial desires of their bodies, even though they knew the laws of the time forbade such a union. It was only their physical love and the strength of their passion which proved to be a power no mere mortal could resist. And if they were truly anything like us, two years later... Millie was fear shitting all over the roof of their Range Rover. Our next live Jimmy Dore show is July 1st in Portland, Oregon. There's a link for tickets for all of our live shows right there. And if you can remember, please take a moment to make sure you're subscribed to the show. It only takes a second. You probably think you're subscribed, but you probably aren't. Just make sure you're subscribed. Click that bell so they send you a notice 
when we drop a video. Otherwise, they won't tell you. And if you become a premium member or a Patreon, we give you hours of bonus material every week. And we do a live chat every Saturday at 2 p.m. Pacific time where you can ask us questions and we'll answer them. Plus, we're on Steam It. We're steaming it right now. Thank you.